Hi everyone, welcome to Live Blogger. In this video, we're going to see how to create a privacy policy page for your website. So let's get started. Privacy policy page is one of the most important pages in your website. It basically describes what data you collect from the visitors and uh, how do you collect the data and uh, what do you do with the data. So this is really important for the visitor to know. So you should definitely have a privacy policy page for your website. Now there's almost all websites out there collect data from the visitors in the form of uh, collecting emails, collecting names and uh, phone numbers and so on. So if you collect any of these information from uh, the visitor, then you should have a privacy policy for sure. Privacy policy should also be available if you use cookies on your website. So cookies are basically used to get more information about the visitor. This can help the website in serving the visitor better by knowing what are the interests of the visitor. And in this way, tailored ads can be shown to the visitor. So if you use Google AdSense or Google Analytics or anything like that, they use cookies on your website to provide their services to the visitor. So if you're using these products, then uh, you should definitely mention that in your privacy policy. If you're planning to apply for AdSense, then one of the required pages is the privacy policy page. So now let's see how to create a privacy policy page. Now there are different ways of creating one. One way is to type everything out by yourselves and uh, explain everything that you're collecting and how you're collecting and what you're gonna do with the information. But this can be quite difficult for you if you are just a beginner and if you're just an individual running a simple website, then you cannot afford to type everything out by yourselves. So there are many other ways of creating a privacy policy page. You can use a privacy policy generator and uh, you can create one for yourself. So let's go to Google and uh, here we will type privacy policy generator. And here we can see there are many different services uh, which uh, help you write a privacy policy page. But we're going to go to this website called privacypolicygenerator.info. So let's click on that. Now here you have to type some information about your company. So for the company name, we'll just type live blogger. And uh, what is the website name? And uh, here you can type the URL of your website. So I'll just type yourwebsite.com. You have to type in the URL of your website over here. So let's click on next. And here we have some questions that uh, we need to answer. So do you use cookies on your website? So we have to select yes if you use cookies. Do you show advertising through Google AdSense on your website? Yes. And uh, do you show advertising from any other parties except Google? So select the appropriate answer for your website. So I'll just select no and then click on next. And then here you have to provide the country, state and your email address. So here we will type India, state Maharashtra. And then type in your email ID over here. All right, so now just click on generate my privacy policy. And here we have the privacy policy for our website. We can see privacy policy for live blogger. And here we have the details of how we collect information from the visitor. All right, so what you can do is just copy this uh, whole text from here and then paste it in your WordPress or blogger pages. Or else you can go ahead and uh, just select all this HTML from here and uh, then copy and paste it in uh, your website and that will work as well. Now once you have created uh, this uh, privacy policy using a privacy policy generator, you should always go ahead and read every single line of uh, this text because there may be something that uh, you don't want for your website or something that you want to add or something that you want to update in uh, this privacy policy. So just go through this privacy policy at least once after creating this. Now, in the same way, you can also create uh, terms and conditions and disclaimer pages. So just Google for page generators for them and uh, you'll find many. There are also some uh, 
paid services uh, which uh, help you create better privacy policies but this should be enough if you are an individual and uh, just uh, getting started so that's basically how you create a privacy policy for your website now adding this to your wordpress or blogger is uh, really simple just go to your pages section and uh, click on create new page and add this text over here and uh, just provide this title and publish it that's it so that's it for this video i hope that you have understood how to create a privacy policy page for your website if you have any doubts you can ask in the comments below and uh, click on the like button if you found this useful and also don't forget to subscribe to this channel to get the latest video updates thanks a lot for watching have a nice day